Hello everyone, welcome back at Take It. The iPhone 13 may be a little ways off at this point, but we have already started seeing plenty of rumors about what Apple has planned for this device. The iPhone 13 will offer a 120Hz LTPO display on both Pro models, improved battery life thanks to a more efficient 5G modem, as well as substantial upgrades to the camera. That includes a lighter sensor on cheaper iPhone 13 and iPhone 13 mini. As for the design, we have heard that the notch size will be reduced and at least one iPhone 13 model may come with a truly portless design. That's actually possible now that we have MagSafe charging. If the iPhone 13 release date follows Apple's pattern for previous launches, we could assume its release on the 4th Friday of the September 2021, that would be September 24th. Famous Apple analyst Ming-Chi Kuo said that Apple will once again offer 4 sizes for the iPhone 13. So you can expect a 5.4-inch iPhone 13 mini, a 6.1-inch iPhone 13, a 6.1-inch iPhone 13 Pro, and a 6.7-inch iPhone 13 Pro Max. Another leak claimed that the iPhone 13 will have a smaller notch. Apple will apparently achieve this notch reduction by combining the infrared flood illuminator, sensor, and dot projector into a single module. With this new tech, we should see a much narrower notch on the iPhone 13. Let's Go Digital published some iPhone 13 renders, actually leveled as the iPhone 12 S Pro, that show off Apple's phone with a smaller notch and a Touch ID sensor under the phone's display. In addition, the iPhone 13 may be slightly thicker, which would allow for a larger battery. The biggest change we can expect from the iPhone 13 is that the one model could feature a portless design. In order to do so, it will drop the lightning port and go for charging and data transfer to be carried out wirelessly. That would be a radical change from the iPhone 12 but could also spark a move for the smartphone world to slowly ditch its reliance on ports and bundled chargers and cables. The iPhone 13 will come with the A15 Bionic processor, a successor to the very powerful A14 Bionic in the iPhone 12, which will boost the overall performance of this device. We haven't heard much about the entire iPhone 13 range yet, but one leak has that iPhone 13 Pro and iPhone 13 Pro Max will offer a new 6-element ultrawide lens. It would also offer autofocus capability. The current iPhone 12 Pro model sports a 5-element ultra-wide angle lens. The more elements in a lens, the better the image quality. Various other reports claim the iPhone 13's camera will get a big hardware boost as well. Analyst Ross Young has predicted that the new Apple phone will come with larger sensors for starters. On top of that, Ming-Chi Kuo has predicted the iPhone 13 Pro and iPhone 13 Pro Max will both include larger apertures on their ultra-wide cameras. That means more light will come in through the camera and improve the picture quality. Well, that will be all for now. Thank you for watching this video and don't forget to subscribe this channel to get daily updates. Till the next time.